Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Project Ascension. We're back on a League 4 server on our Iron Man Nightmare 3 challenge that we're doing. Uh, currently level 30, almost level 31. We're going to be trying to get to the max of 60. So hopefully we can reach that today without dying. Um, there is an XP hotspot over here I wanted to hit up. I'm still in a Darkshire Duskwood area. And there's a couple of quests we're probably going to finish up before we head out of here. Um, I just want to get as much as we can before we head to the next zone. Um, as we progress through the zones, there's just more and more difficulties that we have to be cautious of and stuff like that. So we're going to see how many levels we grab out of this hot spot, if it's uh, going to give us a lot or not. There's also a couple of trees that we might grab while we're here. Boys, that guy was a little bit painful. All right, boys, we just made it to Stranglethor, and I love this place. Uh, you have to watch out, though. There shouldn't be too many bad features and stuff like that, but there is a lot. Um, we got a couple quests. We are 33, almost 34. We're probably going to head up here. Maybe actually I'll head up here, start up here, do all these quests, turn this guy in, and then we'll work our way down. I think that's how the leveling goes anyways. So we'll start there and uh, see if anything cool happens or any cool abilities. Excited to see some new abilities. All right, we got a couple quests, and then we can start on these guys. We got to kill some of these and some extra stuff. I think there's another camp with more quests down here as well. We also have a hot spot, so we can always check that out. There is this Legion invasion, which I'm worried about. I don't know how that operates. I don't want to accidentally run into something or get got by something. Um, so we just have to watch out for that. Really would like to tame a new pet. Um, our boar has been doing fine, but he's just kind of boring. <laughs> but um, I'm just worried about getting got because like they hit you so hard. Plus we're level 30 already. Might as well just keep rolling with the same one. Um, holy shit, that's a big boy. Um, I can probably do one just fine. I just don't really want to jinx it. I can use my uh concussive and everything else. But we'll roll with the boar for now. I named him Barry. You know, what I think I'm gonna do is get a little bit closer to the level and then do it. Because if anything, I can kill him and probably level up and get health. So I think that might be the way to go. Just to give myself a little bit of wiggle room in case something happens. And then I'll also hit myself with a heal beforehand as well. So we'll do that. And then we should be able to tame. I think I'm going to tame the tiger over there. He's level 30. I'm not sure if he's going to automatically... Um... Oh, this, this quest is a pain in the ass. Um, if he's going to like update to my level. Or if he is just going to sit at 30. Or I don't know really how that works. Cause like there's a little bit of features from classic but there's also a lot of features from oh well, that's cool oh that's really cool um there's also a lot of features from like normal game plus just from ascension and it's a little confusing these crocodiles are pretty cool too oh we got the water buff too oh you know what we could use the water buff as an advantage only is you can't move while you're taming, which kind of sucks. All right, I think we got that one. Oh, it's skins. So maybe I just have to get lucky with it then. Oh, there we go. I got one that time. Can I feed this guy some meat? Oh yeah, look at that. There we go. Just care gotta be careful about this water, because I can't see anything in it, but I'm pretty sure there's creatures that roam in it, so. Alright, we got this guy right over here. We're gonna give him a shot. See if I can uh, tame him. That'll give me a little bit while he is uh Yeah, it's just a lot of uh Yeah, I don't want to jinx that. Damn, man. That's scary. You always get someone... Oh, that's a crocodile. Get someone to um, distract him. That would probably be a good idea. Yeah, because I really don't want to die now. Halfway there. Boys, we might do it. We might do it. Had this kind guy come over here and... Uh, Offer to aggro this guy for me, and I can tame him. So it looks like it's working so far. 
Oh, he's barely even taking damage, too. All right, boys, we got him. And uh, we actually have some some talents that we, should, we can do. That's going to be sweet. We don't have the charge, which kind of sucks. But there is the dash. So let's hop that up. Um, and then let's go with the uh, stamina again. So we'll see how that does. Get him out of this prowl. Uh, we're going to have to figure out a name for him at some point. So we keep that on the top of my head. I did give him a little bit of food. It doesn't really do anything, but... Uh, just for fun, and uh, we'll finish up this quest here and see what else we get. We got the rapid fire, which is pretty sweet. So he does look like he's a lot faster. He does also have that dash ability, which might come in handy when he's like chasing things. But he always uses it like randomly. I wish they would maybe like give you an option to tweak that, or they would only use it in combat, or at least something a little bit more efficient. Because like he just randomly does it while we're standing still in like an inn or something. But there, he just uses it again. Which is great when he's fighting, but maybe I can just uh, turn it off and lock it to something. Alright, so we set his dash up to uh, the second button here. And these are both controls, so control 1 control 2. So I should be able to only turn it on when I need him to. So like if I get into a fight, I can tell him to dash and he'll get in there a little bit quicker. Um, and hopefully that works out good as long as I remember about it. So let's, uh, let's tell him attack and then dash. Not enough focus. Oh, because I just spawned and that kind of sucks. Yeah, okay. So we'll have to pay attention for that. It's 30 focus. Okay, let's go after this guy. And then we'll tell him to dash. Yep, there he goes. So yeah, it works good. You just have to make sure that you pay attention to his focus. Which is another crappy thing, but it's alright. Let's hop over here for the mana. All right, we finished the first quest. We got to get a bunch more over here. Also, a lot of new trees here. Palm trees. That's pretty sweet. Can I, help I do like this area over here because there is this vendor here with a repair. And you can just sell all this junk that you don't need. Give some meat to the boy. Where's he Yeah, There he is. Right, let's head this way take care of some of these panthers Alrighty, guys we're back uh, we're level 40 so far we got this awesome looking pet this is actually one of the uh quest bosses that you have to take out uh, i had somebody help me out they were just basically aggroed the pet uh, aggro the tiger and i tamed them so that was awesome shout out to you for helping me out i appreciate that um, we have this tiger which also is pretty cool looking basically the same premise as this guy here um, we have to take him out and he's a white tiger he looks pretty cool but I think this guy is a little bit more unique looking with the stripe that he's got going on. And uh, so, yeah, we're going to take this guy out. He does look really cool. Eventually, maybe I'll tame him, but I'm not worried about it right now. I just got this guy and uh, we'll hop over there. All right, we got everything off cooldown. Let's give it a shot. We'll send in him first. Give him the old bestial wrath and then we'll just light him up. Actually, earlier I almost died because I ran out of bullets and uh, my pet ended up taking a taking a nap. Oh, shit. All right. Well, let's uh, get out of here. Uh, my pet ended up having to take a hit for me because I ran out of bullets and I couldn't really do anything. I didn't have a lot of mana. So I actually ended up having to use a potion. And I think I just kind of hightailed it out of there and it I luckily made it. Um, so this guy summoned some extra people. We have to pay attention to that. And then we also have to make sure a pet doesn't die this time. So we'll revive him and use a little bit of a... I think I have some mana things. Yeah, I was running out of mana so much. It's ridiculous. There is also, um, oh, I also did pick up this nice sword. Eat agility and three stamina. It was a lot better than my two-hander. So I found the shield and I threw this on right away. Just to have a little extra. Um, nothing else too crazy at the moment. A couple pieces of gear, some rings and stuff. There is, oh, here we go. So I wanted to show you guys a couple of things that we got. We did get this dream state, which is a really good perk. And there's three of them. So basically 16% of my intellect turns into mana every five seconds, but it really doesn't seem like much. Um, I played on some casters because they use intellect a lot more and it definitely is noticeable, but like this one doesn't really do too much. Um, they want two handers, which I don't know if there's anything special about it, especially for the nightmare challenge because um, take more damage. So like having the shield is nice to additional block and stuff like that, some extra stats. So I'm not going to really worry about that too much. I know some other ones like require certain things for the abilities, but so far we are good. Um, this was the old thing I had, so yeah, only 7 agility, spirit, 
But uh, the other thing I got now is much better. So we're going to take out all these surrounding tigers first. I know that's not what he was summoning, but we're, we don't want to get more than we need to fight. And our pet has 2k, that's pretty nice. We also got him hooked up with Dash and this, uh, where is it? He has a cower and then also, let's go, I forget where it is, in here. He has this, da no, the boar speed, so it gives him a 30% movement speed all the time, which is awesome. So he's able to basically just always be in front of me, which is important, especially for this challenge. All right, so we are, let's let's just get a little bit more mana, and then we're going to go for it. We're going to keep him topped up, try to just blast uh, this guy out. We have Rapid Fire as well. We'll use that. We also have the Stun, which is a good idea. So we're going to send him in. We're going to get this guy ready, this guy ready, and then we're going to unleash, stun him. And with that, we need to heal our pet. Oh, we gotta take these guys out. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to take these guys out. Oh, our pet. Oh, our pet almost made it. Oh, we're almost dead. Oh, come on, come on. Get out of here. No, boys. Damn, I should have used my disengage. I didn't even think about that. Damn, level 40. Oh, I wasn't such an idiot. I knew that was gonna happen if I didn't do something. I should have used my heal and my disengage and just hightailed it to the water. Damn, boys, that was a good that was a good run too. We were grinding. Um, we actually got tailoring up pretty high too, which sucks. We just have to delete them. Ninety gold's gone. Everything's gone. Damn. <laughs> this is all you can do. You just basically run around undead forever. Well, boys, it was a it was a good run. We got almost a little over halfway there. We'll have to give it another shot. Maybe uh, try up a different class or something like that. Stay tuned. I'm going to try some more of these challenges and everything. Uh, if you liked the video, don't forget to drop that like and subscribe for future videos. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.